This is actually freaking hilarious. So I got up early, super early this morning to come into Grizzly. And I'm like, oh, I should go do a little morning warm up, you know, like before you go to the gym. I dove off into the creek below the lodge and I figured I'd just sneak up through the trees here and get to the lodge and be like, oh, hey guys, what's up? Yeah, no, I'm stucker and shit. up this creek the lodge is literally right there this should be fun <laughs> I get all bucked in a tree there like that. Well, good morning, Grizzly Lodge. To do some work and get stuck in the bush. <laughs> well, I was doing like a morning uh, warm up routine, you know? Like, you know how when you go to the gym, you're supposed to like ride the bike and get your muscles nice and warm? This yeah. Is, this is pre breakfast right now. I haven't even Yeah. I haven't even gotten hungry yet. Oh man. I was pretty close. <laughs> yeah. Oh buddy. Oh good to see you guys. Hey man. <laughs> Look at this. I heard just you know a little bit of throttle. I'm like, man, somebody's playing out here this morning. Right? <laughs> Being the nice guys they are, just came and give me the ski pool. <laughs> I made it. <laughs> Sitting here chatting with guests. Man, who's ripping down there? It's too early. Sure enough, <laughs> Brett's in the bush. Good morning, you filthy animal. What's up, Brett? You ready to play today, dude? Oh, it's gonna be good. Feel like it's so good. I've been here twice, three times this year, and it's been blue mo most of the time. I know. Coming in, the ridge was like glowing, dude. Oh, that would have been it so It looks nice. so good. How's the boost? It's good. Liking it? Flawless. Yes. You got my sled all filled up, Jimmy? Good to go. Thanks, buddy. What's the game plan for the boys today, Taylor? We're gonna go have some fun. You got a little bit of shrapnel in there from yesterday still, dude. Oh, you did. Pretty good video. The snow, the snow came right on the other side. That was pretty close. It was all right. Nice. You boys ready? Let's hit the trail, man. Oh, yes, we are. Yep. Oh, we're just leaving the lodge here. We got a group of four from Quebec, and uh, Taylor says he's got a spot picked out for us. It's looking really awesome out, and uh, looking forward to getting these guys into some train and showing them a good time here at Grizzly Lodge. We're just getting into the alpine here now. Another bluebird day at Grizzly is so sick, dude. So Taylor's just explaining right now to the group, like once we get up on top, don't go squirreling off side to side. He wants to keep the group tight so that we can get into the train that we're gonna go to. Cause we're go we have an end goal today and uh, to get these guys into some untouched snow. Taylor's already challenged me to a climb here.
Come on up, Boosty. Let's see if you can get that boost up here, Taylor. How's that suspension setup I gave you? A lot better, dude. That hell, was wicked. Hell yeah. I think this looks pretty friggin' awesome. You got it all day, dude. It's super gentle. Yeah. Like, you don't go very fast at all. I'll just shoot this side more. Yeah. <laughs> A little bit short, dude. Your sled's over there taking a nap, man. What? Man, I love watching Taylor. <laughs> so squirrely, but so awesome on a sled. He's all, yeah, just follow me down this drainage. We'll see if we get the clients in here. Yeah, right, dude. I'm not taking clients in here. <laughs> We're gonna have fun getting out of here. Oh, I don't think we're getting them in here. No. Well, you see to the right? Yeah. <laughs> I like these missions, dude. Give her another shot. Once you're stuck, give me a shot. I'll come get you. What'd you do to Cheetos, man? He dropped in off kind of the steep, nasty chute on the other side. And then coming out the easy way. But there's a couple turbo trenches in there now. <laughs> and there isn't really much but one line. I just don't know if that's the right group to go in there. <laughs> <laughs> it is really rad in there, though. We can go over to that next one easily. Yeah. There's enough snow to play around in there for a while. Oh yeah, the whole face is up. Yeah. Let's go do it, dude. <laughs>
<laughs> it's getting thick. Welcome to the Grizzly Lodge jungle. He's not too bad, huh? Hey, Steve. Steve, you think the boys are having fun? I think so. Too much fun. Ah, that doesn't Ooh. exist. Yeah, they are. <laughs> okay, so stand up, draw it up, and push it downhill. Get some throttle. Try to breathe back. <laughs> Are you got it. Oh, oh man, it's tough. This is stuff I never thought I could even fucking do. I know I'm not breaking the trail, but fuck. That's it. Down in the wood. We're deep in the bush, Steve. Yep, yep, I see that. It's amazing. What? Here deep in the thick of it in Grizzly and uh, we got the Quebec boys stuck on the hill. One was stood straight up and down. Cheetos is trying bow ties and uh, we are deep down in here, man. Like Taylor just dropped one more ledge and he said, I was multiple helpovers and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get all them guys back up. And, but uh, I just heard Steve say, this is something that he's never experienced in his life and he never thought that he'd even be able to do. So once again, Grizzly Lodge is delivering, man. Thanks for letting me ride the fun one, dude. <laughs> the fun one. Oh, yours doesn't have electric start like my guide slip? <laughs> what is this? I gotta talk to the guy that runs the place. But I'm just gonna go rally the shit out of yours. Sounds good. <laughs> little kid and you just figured out how to wheelie your mountain bike for a long time yeah it doesn't even get old dude yeah well we should probably go get our clients out of here probably <laughs> it's been a good day
Yeah, I wish man. we could drop in below us. Thanks I can't turn the, cam the I can't turn the camera around. Yeah. <laughs> I wish Thanks we could drop. Let me ride the fun one. I got your snowmobile over here, dude. Wait, what? I got your snowmobile over here. Thanks, man. <laughs> Showed some friggin' progress, dude. Yeah, I was pretty happy. Ripping. Pretty happy I finally been able to do one good thing. <laughs> nice work, man. Thank you. A little bit of coaching, a little bit of practice. That's right. You're dialed. I was really trying to think about what you were telling. That feet, move that feet, adjust with the nose up and down. Yep. It worked. Hell yeah. Thanks so much. Now I'm just gonna snake it. Then we'll go that way.
spot on you. came up and around the top of me. What if I descended through the tree well? Yeah, just don't hit me, dude. I'll just turn around and I'll come back up. Okay. in the gnarliest part. <laughs> well, I tried to make there, just lost the speed. Did you see that line up there from when I went back up to fix the frozen throttle cable earlier? How sick. That was my line, dude. <laughs> you guys can't see it, but this hole down here that Taylor just put in. Toss the camera. Oh, you got it. Here. So we're hung up on this and this tree. Hey Landon, I think I'm going to be a little crying warranty on my track. Is it stumps and Dude, rocks rock, and... Tree, half the width of my track. I was full boost down all of it, right to the rock. Or we might just have to flip her over and give her a lug check, man. <laughs> if I'm not missing lugs, I'm going to be thoroughly impressed. <laughs> Taylor and I are so buried in the trees right now. Whew. It's a good thing our clients are good sports. Here, buddy. Oh. oh, thanks, bud. Look at that hole, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Whose idea was it to take this line? <laughs> I was trying to get a little above you to come give you a ski pole, but now I'm... No, I wonder if I can get spun around and get you from the other side. Hey, dude, I thought our day was over. You came back and threw gas in the sled. What's up now? <laughs> it was over. Um... A couple of the guys, or one of the guys, from what I understand, the Wyatt's guiding, saw a sick line, I think, and then uh, got a little too committed. So they've been over the back for a little while, so we're gonna go give them a hand. Look at the sunset Anyways, though, dude. To go ride some sick stuff, so, yeah. When you start dropping into Narville. We're getting close, dude, but holy shit, it is straight down right there. Hey? It's gross down there. Damn. I hope it's charged. That 7 ash dash really gives you a nice lighting, man. Oh, man, they're so good. It's nice being able to see each other. We don't have to yell at each other on the radio. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, I'm behind the green tree. You imagine if Wyatt would spend the money and put that on his snowmobile? <laughs> exactly. We would have been able to find him. We would have been found him already, dude. Well, we found some sleds. We just got to find a guy. We follow the tracks. Yeah. It is gross down there. So I guess this is where they all walk in. That's kind of where we intersected. So yeah. We'll, we'll ask Wyatt if we can follow the walking tracks. And, Cause I ain't walking. <laughs> what Wyatt say about dropping in there? He doesn't think. He said you could go in there a ways for sure on sleds, yeah. but he said at a certain point it feels like it gets a little gnarly. But he doesn't know what's above him because Wyatt yeah. came in from over there. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right. So you're thinking maybe if we get onto the sleds, we could go out that far side and come out yeah. where you and I were riding today. Yeah. Well, what we should do is we should drop as far as we know they can get sleds back to us and yeah. then me and you can grab those two and just bail over the edge and then we can go out past the cliffs the way that we were going. Okay. 
we're not gonna have GPS's because our fancy dashes are on our sleds and they're coming back out this way. <laughs> if we can't get the sled out, we can just bail down into the bottom and then we can ride across. Yeah. Pretty good okay. sense of direction. I put a track in the bottom, so as long as we stay on this side, we'll hit my track and then dangle our way out. Sick, dude. That'd be a sick. So. <laughs> Let's get it. Let's drop in here as far as they can pull sleds. We're kind of sitting on the last. They start getting a little tighter below us and then they're tight right to the bottom, but I think there's nothing in there that scares me. I think we can go down and left. It's the exact same as the, if not worse than the way that, or better than the way that I was thinking you could drop in from looking at it from the other side when we were there this afternoon. So I think uh, we'll just drop down and left. I wish I had this gauge on one of those. <laughs> By the time we're done, just uh, adding some water and a saw to my backpack from my handlebar bag. <clears throat> then we're gonna go for a hike. I really hope we're not that far. I haven't hiked this hard since elk hunting season, dude. I don't even work this hard for a mule deer. What? So I don't even hike this hard for a mule deer. Yeah. But maybe a Moscow mule, I would do a hike for a Moscow mule. Can't read one now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we do it, fellas! <laughs> what up, dudes? Yeah! You guys are in it, dude. Oh, yeah. I can't do film. I like it. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> What's up? Welcome to Grizzly Lodge. A big shot to get from back, Alex. To get back. Yeah. He's the guy why we're here. Yeah. yeah. I, I fucked up. <laughs> Very you fucked up. up or you had to drop oh. in. Like this You'll is a shoot right here. Here. <laughs> shoot that if you, like, It's like a drainage. How far can you see to the bottom? That might be our out. Well, yeah. I just turned up it because I thought it was right out that way. Oh. It doesn't look like it's very nice going down. What do you mean? It's you can steep. check it out. You can, you can go down there and check it out. You'd have no problem pulling that back out. Okay. He said there's a chute right here. And if that's the case, we can just grab the sled. If that's the chute, like then the we're going down and going over to where we were today. It's yeah. like a drainage, basically. Yeah. That might be the way. Oh, yeah? It's not treed. That might be the way out. I and mean, then you guys can walk up. Our two sleds are basically just sitting like 100 yards. We left two sleds up there full They're of half, fuel. More than halfway between here and there. Nice work, fellas. You're all living. <laughs> Thank you very much, man. <laughs> sorry call about this. Oh, they were like, oh. like, call the helicopter. Very sorry we'll pay about for this. It. I'm like, no, no, we're not calling Shit. the helicopter. We'll get you guys out of here. No worries, we're dude. We're ready to pay the helicopter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> beautiful night, though. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful night. night. <laughs> yeah, let's just camp it's here. Too cold. No. Be open on us if we wanting to, just bailing down into the bottom. Whoa. Or going up. Why can't we just keep trending up and across? Yeah, if we keep trending this way, right? If we get treed out or something, at least we're in the, we'll be above more open terrain. Yep. And then we can zip back over and help those guys walk up. That. I think and that we could just like wiggle our way through here, dude. Oh yeah, dude, this is totally rideable terrain in here. Like, it's all day long. We ride this all day long. <laughs> I think we're out, dude. We are, isn't this where we dropped into? Pretty much. Oh, Taylor and I are busting ass right now. We just had to come in here. Uh, one of the guides and they had a client dive off into some like very gnarly terrain. And uh, it's pitch black, the guys are tired. Taylor and I just finished guiding, took our groups back to the lodge, came back, we had an SOS call, and now we're just uh, working our way back up and out of this drainage that they were stuck in. Super tight, like, uh, uh, you know, just super tight, super deep in here. Kind of has like a weird crust layer in there too and it makes things really challenging. But uh, luckily Taylor and I were able to get in here, extract these two sleds. They got our twos back over here this way in about a kilometer. Um, they're in a safe spot. They're gonna be uh, being able to go back to the lodge safe again tonight. <laughs> well, let's get out of here. Yeah, dude. Good night, Brad. Yeah, I'll see Talk you up there, night. dude. Thanks for the help. You. <laughs> Thing, 
right through the tree well. You got no choice, really. Hell yeah, dudes, we're out! Yeah, I could do that. Yeah!